Now to a story the Target 12 investigators broke on WPRI.com. Once a top appointee of embattled Fall River Mayor Jason Correa, an alleged co-conspirator, has now agreed to testify against the mayor if the corruption case against him goes to trial. The major development came to light in court documents unsealed earlier today. And Target 12 investigator Tim White has been covering every step of this case and is here now with the latest developments. In 2016, Mayor Jaisal Correa appointed Hildegard Camara to run a city job training program, a position that pays $84,000 a year. Now Camara has agreed to help prosecutors. Two days before Fall River Mayor Jaisal Correa was arrested at his home on federal corruption charges, Hildegard Camara, who was once in the mayor's inner circle, had quietly signed this cooperation agreement with federal prosecutors. For two weeks, it remained under seal until Tuesday when a federal judge in Boston signed off on its release. According to the document, Camara agreed to cooperate fully with law enforcement and government attorneys and testify before a grand jury hearing or trial if called upon. Camara himself is facing six counts in the Correa case. He's accused of taking part in the extortion and bribery scheme with the 27-year-old mayor. Prosecutors say Correa shook down marijuana businesses who wanted to open up shop in Fall River. As part of the agreement, prosecutors will recommend a reduced sentence if Camara provides substantial assistance to the government. Correa's case is scheduled to go to trial in February, but his attorney tells Target 12 he may ask the judge to split the case into two separate trials. Correa is also facing charges he built investors out of hundreds of thousands of dollars for an app he was developing. Two other co-conspirators pleaded guilty today. Prosecutors described David Hebert and Antonio Costa as middlemen in the bribery scheme. They're scheduled to be sentenced in December. With the Target 12 investigators Tim White, Eyewitness News.